Hey, what's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here, and welcome back to a new episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. In the last episode, we... Oh, what's this picture, first of all? Oh, that's the beast they are talking about uh, down south, I think. Uh, last episode, we... We rescued a dude over here. Uh, which was a part of the... Um, this uh, Great Fairy Fountain questline that we're doing. We're gonna continue on that today, but first also I wanna give some information. I'm actually going away on a vacation here in the upcoming days. So starting from this video and forward in roughly 8 or 9 days, I'm only gonna upload one video per day. Because that is because otherwise I'm gonna run out of videos uh, and I don't wanna do that. So for your information, the next coming seven and eight days will be one upload per day. I hope it's okay by all of you. Uh, let's continue on today's episode now. So we're gonna start with just quick traveling up here. And this is why I also have the cold cloth on. It's cold up here. There is my golden beauty also. Uh, but now we're here for this thing. Our Estus is back. Yes, he is. Hello, hello. I know you, traveler. We had a delightful development. Look. I mean, listen, it's Eustus. He and his horn are back in our troop. It's heartbreaking to think of the poor fellow getting stuck in, in a hole on the way to Rito village. <laughs> Note to self, Eustus doesn't get to drive the cart anymore. But I'm glad he's out of his funk and fit as a fiddle. Eustus' horn will blow the stable trotters back on course. Now that Eustus is here, we can bring the sound of his horn to the great fairy. It would be wonderful if we could go and perform for her right now. That is what we're going to do. But of course, there's always something holding up the show. Do we need to fix your cart again? <laughs> Our breezy roof is broken, so we'd be at the mercy of the elements. Imagine if we get caught in the snow. Why, we might fall ill, and how could we perform at our best then? I did try to attach a roof to a breezer. Uh, alas, I couldn't reach high enough to do more than set up some posts. Let me fix it for you then. If we can put up a roof on Breezer, our performance for the Great Fairy is as good as cancelled. Uh, if we can't put up, then let's fix it for you guys. And here I actually... Imagine that this big one should be enough. As a roof. So I would say that that covers the whole cart. Yeah. We simply must put on a performance for the Great Fairy. Our music will be just the thing to encourage her to get out of her bud. With the roof of a breezer in despair, we can't reach her. I'll take you. Did I hear you say you'll take us where the Great Fairy waits? But for that, uh, we'd have to... What's this? Our breezer has been fitted with a roof. Correct, correct. The world hasn't abandoned us. I will never forget your kindness. I accept your offer. All aboard, everyone. If they're chilling there... I guess we need to get the harness on our horsey also. Let's... I'm not used to the speed here. <laughs> of this horse. I want to customize the horse, thank you. Oh. So what would you like to do? I would change equipment and put on the towing harness. Yes. Oh. Nothing else I want to do. Back it up a bit. I think that should be enough. No. There we go. Nope. <laughs> Somehow that didn't work. 
attach it here then instead. Oh, that's a bit not the straightest, but it will work. Oh my god. That's bad. I think we got one of them, at least. Maybe the other one got scared from that. <sighs> Where is the best way to approach this? I think from the left side here. You're not falling out, chill. There in a second now. Oi! Oh, great fairy, the stable trotters her has arrived. We've done it, you have our thanks. You're taking us right to where we needed to be. All right, everyone, no time to dwaddle. Strike up the band, our audience is the great fairy herself. Very nice, very nice. Also, it's hype being done with this quest line. I can't get over those moans, though. Always so intense. Yahoo! Yahoo! The great fairy has returned to us. Uh, this this is one of the greatest days of my life. Uh. The great fairy herself enjoyed my humble horn playing. What a day. What a divine presence. What splendor. I will remember this moment all my life. Oh. We can't hang around all day. We must return to the stable to share the good news. Yeah, yeah. Thank you again. Which leaves only your reward. Now, now, don't be shy. I actually think I deserve a bit more pay for the last great fairy hair, but sure. Oopsie, that's left the old wallet pretty light. But that's no excuse to skimp on our thanks. A clear conscience is worth every rupee. The captivating Mia is now as peace, but she wasn't the only great fairy shot away in Flowerbud. That's why the show must go on, to the next great fairy in hiding place. Oh yes, I'll be borrowing this horse so that I can get to the next destination. But it won't cause you any trouble. We'll do the responsible thing and return your steed to a stable. Don't you worry. So it's one more great fairy, huh? Yeah, yeah. Well done, good tra traveler, good luck. So where is the, the last one? I thought I saw everyone on the map. Like all the locations for it. Mm -hmm. So you're the one who arranged those soothing sounds for me. I would have liked to be released by something bigger, but... Oh. Or someone bigger. Well, a slim little lad like you is fine, too, I suppose. It seems uh, the world is not so corrupted as I thought. To thank you for opening my eyes, I can enhance your clothing. But of course, I require the necessary materials to do it. Huh. With the power available to me, I can greatly enhance your clothing. So here you can do the the last enhance, I guess. Ooh, nice. So we're gonna do these two, level three. I guess. This is actually- oh damn. We don't have the money, huh? Okay. And she told me her where the last one was, and I just skipped that text. That was no good. Ah, you come here again. Okay, let me see your clothes. Okay, no thanks. Hmm, so long for now, I suppose. Once you have some clothing you want to upgrade, come back anytime. See you. Damn, now I missed where the next location was. That's my bad. Maybe I can see it in the when I'm editing this video. If we don't, maybe we got a new to get a new quest line. The 
Beast and the Princess. Bring peace to Hebra. South Tabanta Snowfield. And that's just some fighting quest. Three more geoglyphs. Hmm. That one is done. Ah, uh, here is one that's not done, huh? Yeah, that's correct, because they get another icon when they're li lit up. So let's go to this one then, because I, I guess we have a stable close by. Usually they are. The closest way to get there is... ...via this one, I guess. So we have good armor at the moment. We need more though. But this is nice. For the moment being. Towards the blue thing. On the minimap. Maybe also change to falling clothes and stuff. And also where is that thing? Like the next falling. I think that's the next falling area. Which we should do, because that will help our traveling a lot. And also I think this is one also. I'm thinking after we get to the... That's far, dude. That's really far. I think we... different plans. Uh, we... We get the falling gear first. I think that's actually a smart thing to do. That means there is the thing I I think is the falling uh, challenge. And also, we've been on this place right in front of us. Maybe. The thing is, we don't we don't gonna reach the top platform from here either way, so we can just actually just drop down here. See what we can get. Here is probably some apples. I thought I saw a golden one, but maybe that one fell down. Yeah, they actually fell down if fall down if I cut down the trees. That's not good. Yes, grab this as well. And we have this place. There is a shrine that we haven't done. But this is actually good. We do this first. Yes, I hear you. I hear you. So where are you hiding? Green little crystal. It's... where? Down? Okay, that boss has it. Maybe you can use this to shoot yourself up there. I don't think so. Also gonna check this uh, gumball machine. I want a place with easy access for springs and fans. 
That would be nice. Like those two together on a... Oh, I sh shouldn't use them. I should hold them. <laughs> Steering wheel. What's this? Oh, there they are. Nice. I wanted them for a bit as well, so... So that's nice, actually, that we found a place for that. Why does this look so sus? This hole here looked like maybe you could break it, but I don't think you can. Doesn't take us all the way there, but it makes us reach this platform where we have the shrine at least. Change to fighting cloth, and those I guess are the best. So he has the. Like his heart thing on his hand. If we're quick, we can actually just drop down here. Grab it quickly. We get a free hit in, in the beginning here. Maybe we can even finish him before... Yeah. <laughs> That's so cheesy. But I'll take it. I'm not sure if anything needs this, but let's put it there for now. Better than nothing. So that was it, huh? The rockets to gain, gain the height. And then maybe actually a steering wheel for... Um, steering while the rockets are going. So well, we're going pretty far up, actually. Let me just attach you there. I'm not sure you should be attached to there. And I'm gonna take out steering wheels. Why not? I'm not sure how many of these I will need. Uh, let's do three on each side. I think it's it might be a bit overkill, but... I'd rather take too many than too few. Then we want to go like a slightly left also. Oh freak. We put one for like steering the whole thing that way. Then we might actually have enough. That was pretty good actually. Would have needed maybe one more for the um, for the left turn there. Lucky thing we still have a lot of this in our inventory. Then we can just put one like that. No, 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 no. <laughs> Oh, we went a bit too far. Okay. We just... I guess we will have to drop the stone while we're going over the... While we're going over the platform. 
So do something like that. And then off. Yes, drop it. Oh my god, I thought I was in the middle. But I was not. <laughs> I was close of uh, losing this stone. Because what happens if you drop it down? Do you have to actually carry it up to the to this platform again? Because that are really that's a long travel. And can it be Aurora's blessing inside here? If I could guess, I would think so. It was. Yep. Mm. Don't really need it. need to go and pray partly because we need to partly because we need um, the two extra lives uh, heart containers and also we want to upgrade the sage because we have one one of those also sage wheels we have enough for one one sage upgrade which probably gonna be the glass Tulin's Sage, because that's the most uh, worth of them all, I think. Oh, that's not good. Now I'm going to this, uh, I think that's a Falling Course as well. And hopefully you can get one more of the Falling Cloth, and then I think I saw the last one also on the minimap. I'm gonna go and get that as well. be enough. You should be able to fall here now. Maybe not all the way, but at least almost all the way. Let's check out this gumball machine first. Always exciting to do. Construct head. Mm, it's like uh, tr tracking on the when you're fighting. It's like the uh, aimbot for your contraptions. Okay, so we need to find that construct dude. Here he is. The radiant light of the sun warms both body and spirit. Welcome to the dives ceremony. Are you ready to begin? The time is now for you to show your courage. Come test your metal in this dive ceremony. I'll do it. First thing first, we should perform a trial run of the course. Your goal is to go through all the rings, do not worry about the time limit yet. I will show you the way, register yourself at the terminal first, then we can begin. First we have a try run. We're still gonna change the falling cloth here. Nice. 
We can almost dive the whole... Ah, oh, there... Okay, so... The... Third to last one I need to think about when we do it on timer. I'm just gonna go and do the shrine first. There's probably a star or a blessing here as well. Oh, it's not? Oh my god. It's a fighting... Uh, fighting shrine in complete darkness, huh? The hell? Ah, it's shields with light on, okay. Let's grab both, why not? Also, isn't the darkness... Can it not be good for me? What happens if I... Oh my god. Should have one enemy on this side here, man. Yeah. It should just be at least until the that one breaks, yeah. Now we're in a bit of more trouble here. Super quick. That's not good. Come on. How can it already break, huh? Thank you. One more flame emitter club. Let's grab these rubies. I think we're gonna lose them either way. Nice. I thought this shrine would have been mo much more difficult than it was. I have a... I remember when you did the like darkness in Breath of the Wild, that small island thing. That was a real pain to do. It's finally time to do the falling. Superb so technique uh, suggested that you've done this before. I accept greatness from you in the real ceremony. Yes, I have come to do the ceremony. Go ahead, take the Sonai charge. 35 seconds, and we need to. Remember, the third to last one is the one we cannot fall so fast on. So here in the beginning we can... should be able to just dive straight ahead. I think it can be this one that's the... bit difficult one, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. But this is okay, and then the last one is no problem at all. Don't tell me 20 is the record I need to beat, also. Your time was 20.79. What an unbelievably magnificent showing. 
This is proof of your maturity. You have more than earned this. Thank you, thank you. You're faster and more courage than any I have witnessed. Take this in honor of your record. Okay, so we did the record directly. Nice. So we don't have to do this again. We don't need to do it again. So now we have two pieces, which is so nice. I wonder why I have waited so long on doing this. Should have done them all in the beginning of the playthrough. Where was the last one? I'm thinking it's this one. The easiest is via this. Is it that one? I'm not sure if it's this one here. That's those islands. And what is this island then? Oh, that's the one I have done, I think. The one with the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's cold. Is that enough? No. Why am I blind? There? Also, have we done that memory down there? Don't think so. I think that's. Uh... I'm not sure what that is. Let's stop here for now. This looks a bit interesting. So why are there platforms here? Like what purpose does it serve? I'm not sure if it even has a purpose, this island. Except of this little car here, which I'm gonna try. This is like a really expensive version of our flying car. Oh, but, okay, we should we should go up here, huh? That's the that's what they want. Yeah, and there is a shrine as well. Someone shooting on me. It's nice that we get some um, Sky Island also explored while we're up here. I guess we're gonna change to this flying car here to get some new batteries. Hopefully the shrine stone wasn't somewhere on those islands that we started at. That would be a bit of a pain. I think that's enough. Okay, so where are you hiding? Nice little bird getting into the frame there. Oh my god, you're up there, huh? Then I shouldn't have uh, dropped the... the car, I guess. It's a bit pre premature, but there we have one more. I saw one in the distance there. Springs? Probably fans at this place. Frost emitter, mirror, frost emitter, battery, wing. Okay, so only things I really didn't need. Oops. 
I was almost really bad. Also, I guess this is something I haven't seen before. We should do that, and we should also say thank you for the meat. And I saw my album was full. I don't want to delete anything yet, because I have... Uh... <sighs> what the hell is this? Oh, golden apples also. snap the pick on this okay we have to this one we have um... but actually if we do select all then we just deselect this I guess everything with an extra icon we can deselect and also these ones memories of course Actually, this one can go now. Maybe not. They're cute. Delete. That's actually good. I tried to snap a picture on you. I guess not. Now I have just failed everything here. No worries. I thought those were green, the Endora shrooms. Okay. Let's keep going. Can I grab some apples? Ooh, here is a lot of apples. This is so good for cooking. But the apples really need to stop going over the... Down like the side here and down. It's not so kind. I want those apples. Is that it, apple-wise? At least for now. And do this for one extra. Well, let's go and get the shrine. So here I'm guessing uh, it's roughly the same as the island we was in, was it last episode or two episodes ago? Where um, it was like an entrance on the backside. Maybe we should park it at the top here first, because I see some apple trees, which I wanna quickly grab here. Yeah, it looks like the same. Like, is that two golden boys? Was. King hell. Like this far the apple goes. It's not doesn't feel so accurate that they go so far. And uh, Kuroko, yeah. Kuroko? Ah, it's a sniper Kuroko. Oh. Okay, it's quick. Oh. Yeah. Soon we have one more weapon slot. That's hype. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, should I have snapped a picture on that? But that's good with a big radish, because we can plant those in uh, Ateno village, I think. Which is nice. Okay, an entrance of some sort. Maybe it wasn't the smartest to drop my flying machine there. But I'm trying to figure out where the entrance is. Maybe if we... Here it is, here it is. Also, it was on the front. <laughs> I just missed it, huh? Nice with little supply of dazzle fruit also. And don't I don't have any fire. Will that work? That will work. If I remember don't I have a yeah I have this. Two fans, and I guess we want them on the tips. Maybe not like that, though. Maybe we can actually have them in the back, like this, and then on top of each, each other. Like something like this. And then stone. I guess we're gonna put the stone a bit in the front here. Two batteries. Because why not? They're free. And a little steering wheel for me. And we should be done. I think I need to do a wider exit here for me. That should be enough. Well, this is a good looking little flying machine actually. I told you to land. This is no good. I'm starting to fear that the glider will run out of... Okay. Let me just crash land instead. Nice. Oh my god. There we go. The ice guides you. Okay. It's, it's ice emitters. Yeah. I guess. Okay. This ice fruit I'm not gonna use, I'm just gonna say thank you for free loot. I guess you're gonna create um, ice blocks on the water here with the help of this thing. Oh my God. And then use that ice to somehow glide. Oh, you should glide the ice on this. Okay, okay, I understand. 
Take this up here. Okay, so what I'm wondering if, first of all, because you see it's some steel over there as well. If I just do this, what happens? That was actually enough. Nice. The hell? That's a weird looking shrine. Okay, so some more ice fruits. That should be enough for a start. Okay, so here you want to like... How do you want to glide here? That could actually be good. <laughs> yeah. Nice. That's a calculated move by me. We can say at least. Not at all, just luck. And also nice with the refill on ice roots. Soon we have three hearts. I guess when we do the training for the falling here, that will give us the, the last shrine needed for upgrading another heart container here. Always start with checking this out. To see what we can we can get fire hydrants ah springs and steering wheels nice that makes this thing pretty good actually and I want some springs so I'm actually gonna do one more hopefully you can get some more springs now I think we have four. So let's go and talk to this. I'm up for a challenge. Okay, so we start with the trial run. And then we do the, the real run. We're gonna need this, but also this. I wonder how good... Because I haven't really fell with the new gear yet. Like how the control is. Okay, that's really good control. So one there. Okay, so this is a bit more uh, dangerous, actually. Oh! 
Okay. It's closed. Oop. Yeah, that one was... I'm not really... Didn't see that one coming, huh? Okay. I think I got it. I think I got it. Go and do the shrine first. Nice. A quick little shrine here. With a really, really nice reward. I gladly take a diamond. There we have it. Three full heart containers. So after the hauling here, we're gonna go and upgrade those. It's bad. I'm, I was looking at the loading screen while I was waiting there um, after the shrine. And I saw that I have almost found as many Kuroko seeds as shrines, which is bad because Kurokos I think outnumber shrines like eight or nine to one. So you can say I haven't been good at the finding of Kuroko seeds. But I also have ignored a lot of those who needs like help tra uh, traveling and stuff. Okay, so we're gonna pass through this thing in 35 seconds. To get the last piece of falling gear. Hopefully we will manage. What was ah oh, this this one? And now it's the sharp right turn, so you don't die. Yeah. And now we can just fall straight down. Nice. New record as well. Your time is 24.13. I do not recall ever seeing a faster time than that. First thing first, I have heard I have here the proof of your maturity. You have earned it. Nice, nice, nice. And we get a large zone I charge. Thank you. Okay, I just have to try it out. A new fall gear here. So now we have three. Three out of three in Sky Mobility here. Wow, damn. Yeah, I should have done this much, much earlier. That's actually crazy. Okay. But uh, let's go to... One part of me want to go to Lookout Landing, because then we can also upgrade the batteries. So we're going to do that, because we have a lot of uh, crystallized charges. A lot of things should have happened here in Lookout Landing since we was here the last time. And now I'll talk to this girl also and her hear if she has something new to tell us. Yosha here. Uh, Swordsman, welcome back. I know it's rough because we still don't know where Princess Zelda is. She disappeared underground, so there might be some connection to the deaths. <laughs> I'll continue my research on it. Okay, nothing new. Huh? But I know we sh we have a main quest here. We should talk to... Is it Pura again? Saying that we've done all the regional phenomena. But I w don't want to do that too early though. Oh my god, so we... 18 away from one more battery charge. Take those two parts. Gladly. Now we have five and one extra little one. 
Was it eight? That was maximum. I'm not. I think it was, but I don't really remember. And also, what do you have? That one we already have. But I also saw you had something I could read then location. Offer 100 posts to me if you end with the, one of my brethren. But I think we already have one of those. It's like the big dudes in the that like these ones. Bargainer statue. But who knows? Let's just pay 100 posts. I acknowledge your offering. I will tell you of the location of one of my brethren in the depths of the land. Okay, it was those we paid for. Yeah, then we don't need to do that again. At least for now. Maybe they offer different things for sale. Here, nothing new here. Like, does anyone offer a quest or something? That is down there. It's really empty down here also. Considering how it was earlier. Okay, who cares? Let's go here and get our heart containers and also our first upgrade on the sages. So we want Tulin. Strengthened Vow of Tulin, Sage of Wind. You reinforced Mond with Tulin has increased his avatar's attack power. Nice. And we're not done. Three heart containers, please. We're approaching, uh, after these three, we're soon at the second road of hearts, which is nice. And one last, come on. Very nice. Let me ascend here quickly. Just gonna go and uh, buy some arrows. Actually, and why are you looking at the sky, huh? Are you looking at the castle, maybe? And also, was was the castle always that high up? Yeah, it must have been. <laughs> okay, you're still here. At Selling things, huh? I thought you would go back to your village. Thank you for telling me about the situation in Lurlin village. I can't tell you how upset I was when I heard those pirates had trashed everything. Now I'd be able to do business with a clear head. I thought you would um, not be here anymore. But I'm mistaken, I guess. Let's buy out all of your arrows. We actually should sell something because we need cash. Type. I have eight of the diamonds now, so we can probably sell two. Ah. That should oh. be enough for now, actually. Ah. And what are you selling? Radiant shirt, stealth, flame guard, cold resistance. Yeah, 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 yeah. But also, I'm looking at the time now. This can be a good place to, to end today's episode. If you have enjoyed watching today's video, please consider leaving a like. It helps me a lot. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. This has been 23. I will see you tomorrow with a new video. Bye-bye.